Hey there, welcome to the latest episode of The Sexy Thyroid Solution. I'm your host, Angela Brown. So today we're gonna talk all about alcohol and your thyroid, but if you could do me a really big favor, if you're watching this on YouTube, if you could go ahead and subscribe to my channel and then hit that bell so you get a notification every time I release a new video. And then if you're watching this on my other social channels, share this with someone who could benefit from this. So this is a subject that I get asked a lot about, particularly when um, the holidays are coming up and we're approaching those. Um, so I do get asked quite often is how does alcohol affect thyroid function? Um, so first and foremost, it absolutely does affect it. Um, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but it is absolutely true that um, thyroid function can drastically be affected um, by drinking alcohol. And I wanted to just kind of uh, point out a few things for you that will kind of help sort of guide you as to whether you should drink alcohol or not, particularly if you do have a slow thyroid. So regular drinking um, can actually inhibit thyroid hormones T3 and T4. So if you um, watch my other videos, you know I've talked a lot about this, that T3 is your active thyroid hormone, T4 is inactive thyroid hormone. So it can actually inhibit those hormones um, when you are consistently drinking alcohol. Um, now, consistently, it can be very different for different people, um, but keep in mind that um, drinking alcohol a lot of times will actually reduce um, the activity of an enzyme that helps convert T4 to T3. So T3, again, is that um, active thyroid hormone, but you only make like 20% of this. You don't make very much of it. So you have to convert your inactive thyroid hormone, which is your T4, you convert that over to your T3. There's a little enzyme that you need um, in order for this to happen. And the activity of that enzyme can really get blunted. It can get shut down um, with drinking alcohol. So that's another way that it can affect your thyroid. And another way that it can also is um, when you have um, alcohol in your system and it's pretty consistent where you have alcohol in your system, um, it can even blunt um, thyroid stimulating hormone. And thyroid stimulating hormone um, is the typical one that you hear about TSH. That's what gets checked on um, a thyroid panel, um, it can inhibit that. TSH is the um, hormone that comes from your brain. It's not a thyroid hormone, um, it's a brain one. So it comes from your brain and it signals your thyroid that you need more T3 or you need, need more T4. Um, it's going to blunt that. It will slow down the activity of that hormone. So you get a reduction in T3 and T4 that way as well. So. Um, there's a lot of ways that the thyroid can be um, connected to um, alcohol and how it can be slowed down from that. Um, and one last one um, that there's a little bit more research coming out on this is that alcohol, and we're talking a consistent amount, probably drinking you know two to three drinks um, every single week, um, maybe even a daily thing where um, the alcohol can actually decrease the volume of your actual thyroid. Um, this is more of like an inflammatory thing where the, the function of the actual thyroid gland um, just becomes really diminished. So the thyroid volume itself will reduce. So you can see there's this consistent pattern where um, alcohol can definitely cause an issue with your thyroid function, with the hormone function. Um, so my advice typically is to reduce the amount of alcohol as much as possible, particularly if you are struggling with a slow thyroid or you think that you have a slow thyroid, I would be very, very careful with um, the alcohol that you're drinking, the amount that you're drinking. Um, again, with holidays coming up, this is the common time where people are drinking a, quite a bit more alcohol or especially if they're stressed out. Um, so I would reach for something else other than alcohol if you possibly can um, and try to find alternatives as much as you can that will make you just as happy um, even though you're not drinking the alcohol. So if you have questions with this, definitely reach out, let me know and I'll see you in the next video, bye.